Hello everyone. Today's tutorial is primarily about member vault. In essence, member vault is an almost all encompassing membership platform that can handle a variety of tasks for you, including hosting courses, managing memberships and cl collecting payments for your goods and services. It's easier than it may sound to create your own marketplace on member vault apart platform for relationship marketing you can sell things sell coaching services and offer courses in your market basically you can sell whatever you produce with member vault it's easier than it may sound to create your own marketplace on member vault a platform for relationship marketing you can sell things sell coaching services and offer courses in your market basically you can sell whatever you produce with member vault first i am going to open google chrome then I am going to search for member vault, click member vault and then I'll check the privacy statement. After that I'll scroll down the page and visit it. There will be a many of options like how to easily convert sales from traffic on YouTube. After that I'll scroll up and click on the sign up option. Following that a sign up page will display on the screen. Fill in your name first, then enter your business name, your email a last check of terms and conditions and then click the sign up button when you click start playing on the following screen your document will open on the left side of your computer click integration to open it there are three options available under the integration option payment advanced and other then select the help link that is located below the integration our assistance page will now be displayed to us with a few options including member vault home base, Facebook collaboration group, GDPR and legal information. And the last one is live office hours. Next select general settings. We have a lot of options in general settings. Account settings include time zone, date format which you can modify to meet your needs, email consent showing leaderboard and other options. You can adjust the default setting to suit your preferences. After finishing your work, you can save your settings. There are a few options in the blog settings that sh you should fill out accurately based on your needs. Next, save the blog settings. Set the, set the sidebar settings by descending. Simply copy and paste the CTL links into the box. Cite my videos CTA in your response. Now type the CTA's consent. Now type the CTA's content. Enter the data in your own way. Font settings will be available on the top option where you can change the color, bold, italic, and align the text. Bullet placement makes a link. Add an image. Later, box will show up on the screen. All you have to do is save it and type in the source alternative description image title width and height also we can add the image in CTA just click and choose the image from your computer you are able to delete the image cancel the image and also save the settings the product categories are now open we have more learning options here we can also add a category just click it on screen category settings are displayed put the title here you can include any additional details you would like to share about this category by using the option mentioned on the right side of the description box you can also alter the properties of the content font alignment links and it image can all be changed as soon as I click an image a box where you can enter the images source description title width and height appears Additionally, we can edit and add media, enter the source and save the file. This is the source code. We can also personalize and save. The link will also edit and insert. So this is all about category setting. Click on add category option. Now you are able to add category easily. On the left side of the page below the product category, there will be custom domain. Now the custom domain will be appear on the screen there is option to how to use custom domain below this there will be a complete detail about custom domain 
click on it so set so the step of the custom domain will be shown here we have multiple steps like how to verify domain own ownership as well as point your custom domain to mv on the left side of the screen click on payment option then the payment integration page will appear in front of us there is option of stripe below this people option we have many more options like api users name api password and signature just fill the given option and see if people sitting below the payment option click on advanced integration on the page of advanced integration we have following options like zapier activate campaign automation convert kit automation mailchimp audience trip automation infusion soft sequence on track port on Traport webhook now open the first option here we have link of member vault integration page just scroll down the page there will be all instructions about the advanced settings like how to choose app and events how to choose action how to supply your name how to add user to your product as soon as I scroll down the page there will be more and more options regarding to advanced settings you can follow all the steps as well now on the left side of the screen there will be appearance option drop down and see many more options like branding welcome area announcement bar footer etc click on branding option the page of branding will appear on the screen here you can add title and logos or and favicon scroll down and change body background color according to your need also change and select any color for body text header background also shown for color property same you can change the color of header text background button background and button text after color the text option are front after color the next options are font click on it you can edit your title font body font base font size custom default you can edit according to your need there is also account preview option you can see in new window mobile and full as well just try different models just try different modes click on welcome area and customize the welcome area setting you can change the title welcome text with different options also change the media image just change the welcome images whatever you want scroll down and fill other entities fill the primary button text secondary button text secondary button url button background color as well on the left side you can edit your affiliate setting on user option you can add user and change settings as well on constant option there will be option of product where you can add your new product in activity option there will be many settings and dashboard on our home screen just scroll down and able to see dashboard totals and daily user activity so this is our tutorial about member vault i hope you can understand all points regarding this lecture and learn about the topic if you have any query about this tutorial then you can drop your questions in comment section and get help so this is conclusion of our today's video stay safe